Hi everyone, this is Cody from Bridgecom Systems, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to find your phone's hotspot Wi-Fi credentials to program into your DV Mega. So, if you're on an iPhone, what you want to do is go to Settings, then go to Personal Hotspot, which you can see here, and then you want to go ahead and turn it on. Now, the name of the hotspot, in this case, it says Jared's iPhone. On this iPhone, that may not work with Pi-Star because of the apostrophe. Now this is how your iPhone will come standard with a, a username like that. So we want to go back out here, go down to General, go to About. We can change the name of the iPhone here. So I'm going to take it back and we'll just name it to Jared. We could do one, two, three. I mean, you can do anything you want here. Uh, but just don't do any special characters, and it's a good idea to leave out the spaces. So we're going to go back in here, personal hotspot, and now we can see the new username. What's, what the username is, is the part right inside those quotation marks there. And then our password here, uh, once again, don't use special characters, uh, and pay attention to capital letters, like there's a capital P. It is everything here, the username and password is very case sensitive, uh, so we have to pay attention to that. But it's really that simple, so we go ahead and put these into the uh, PyStar system, and that's how it works for an iPhone. Now over here on an Android, what you want to do, there's two ways to go to settings. You may have it on your home screen, or you can swipe down from the top and go to settings this way. Then just go to connections, um, and then down here you'll see a mobile hotspot and tethering. So we're going to go ahead and switch this on. Turn on. Then uh, open it up. But there's your uh, username and password. Now, once again, you don't want to have any special characters, uh, and I believe it's a good idea not to have spaces either. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Now you can go ahead and change either of them, but we'll just go back out the home screen here. So that's it for now. Hopefully the video was helpful to you. If you did like it, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to like us on Facebook, subscribe to our YouTube channel, hit that notification bell. You don't want to miss out on any awesome content coming your way. Once again, I'm Cody from Bridgecom Systems, 7-3.